Mr. T goes to a Tupperware party, will not be seen at this time, in order that we may bring you this after-party mess. today, and not one of us has died of food poisoning yet. Amazing. Oh, uh, gee, thanks, kids. This is the happiest day of my life, and I want each of you to have a piece of my special cake. Whoa. Interesting green icing, Burfie. What mm -hmm. flavor is it? Oh, uh, no, it's not a flavor. That's moldy fungus. I uh, prepared this uh, cake ten years ago, and just for such a special occasion. All right, wait, let me pry this apart there. Oh, look, there's an ant farm in there. Oh! Hold on, wait a minute, wait. Alanis, oh, that's a girl. I'll save this and put it in my mixture for the uh, uh, 20th anniversary uh, cake. <laughs> from the Presidente. Yeah, sounds like they're having a good time. Oh, sure, a few drinks and some of my special enchiladas. A couple of chiquitas are going to jump out of a cake. What? And then we are going to have one great big finale. Oh, yeah, what's the finale? Oh, it's going to be a beautiful finale. A great display of fireworks. Oh, oh, how... Uh, too bad you're going to miss it. Hey, guys, let's party! Adam, look at this. Lots of food, lots of drinks, the latest rock videos. Parents gone for the weekend, house all to ourselves. This is gonna be one fantastic party. And most of all, it's gonna be a lot of girls here. <laughs> Speaking of girls, when are they coming? Adam, calm your hormones, okay? I mean, they'll be here. You know, women have to take a long time putting on their makeup. And making themselves look sexy. <laughs> oh, uh, who'd you invite anyway? Well, I invited lots of girls. Yeah, yeah? Uh, I invited Cindy. S Cindy who? Cindy Lauper, of course. You mean the weird singer? Yeah, you know, Cindy Lauper. Girls just wanna have fun, and she's gonna have fun, and so are we. I invited Tina Turner, Madonna, Chrissy Boone, Cheryl Wait, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. You mean you didn't invite any of the girls that we know? Like the girls from school? Adam. With women like Christy Brinkley and, and Tina Turner here, who's gonna have time for normal girls? Well, better get started on these cheesies. It's an awful lot for just the, the two of us. Mm. Adam, do you seriously think Madonna would stand me up? <laughs> Hi, and welcome to what might actually be a fun episode if you can't do that on television. Well, for me, anyway, because it's party time! We have finally kind of tricked the producers into letting us have a party by doing a show about huh? parties. Huh? Hey, Ross, huh? you all ready to party? <laughs> uh, Christine, the uh, producers just informed me that the uh, budget for the party has been uh, severely cut. <laughs> Ross, what about all the food we plan to buy? That's it. This is it? Mm -hmm. well, what about the sound system that we were gonna rent and all the records? Wait a minute. I don't know. The producer's nephew, Arnie, is gonna play his accordion polkas for us. In fact, he's uh, practicing right now. Listen. Beautiful, Arnie. <laughs> all righty to party. <laughs> Yeah, well, have a cracker and brush up on your polka. Manus, what's wrong? Why aren't you having a good time? Because I'm bored, Adam. The music stinks and the people 
are creeps. Oh, well, that's no reason for you not to have any fun. Would you just get lost? My parents are coming to get me soon anyway. Hey, hey, guys, Alanis doesn't have any fun. Let's show her a good time. Hey, Alanis, try some chips. Oh, I, I, um, let's change the tape to something Alanis likes. Hey, 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 Alanis, you want to dance with me? Are you kidding? You get trampled to death? With me, Alanis? Uh, dance with me. Hey, hey, whoa. There's one thing I know. It's how to get attention at a party. Well, come on, Alanis, come on. Hey, Alanis, come on. Boys, this evening is going to be really exciting. We're going to have fun, fun, fun. <laughs> we're in trouble now. What do you mean trouble, Adam? He said we're going to have lots of fun. He said it's going to be really exciting. Come on, Alistair, haven't you learned yet? When an adult says we're going to have lots of fun or it's going to be really exciting, it means it's going to be dull, 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 <laughs> and boring. Oh, no. Where, where is my projector? <laughs> Gillard! Oh. <laughs> oh! How's the party going? Oh, it's just wonderful, wonderful. It's so wunderbar that I'm going to take you back to the party. Uh, no. Mm -hmm. You see, the guards all chipped in and they bought me a beautiful birthday present, a battery-operated torture machine. Uh, except that there's uh, one thing missing, so it won't work. Uh, well, you don't know how sorry I am to hear that the batteries weren't included. No, 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 not the batteries. A prisoner to torture. <laughs> Come on, you're coming with me. Oh, oh, Alistair, the boys are just dying to see you. <laughs> well, are you having a time? <laughs> All right. All oh, night. Hey, gang. Gang. It's... Party time! Wahoo! I heard about the bad party news and I went out and I bought all this stuff out of my own money just for you. <laughs> Wait a minute. Is he sick or something? Maybe we better call a doctor. No, I wouldn't worry about Ross. This is probably just the introduction to the opposites. <laughs> we better dig in fast! <laughs> Home and I... <gasps> what went on in here while we were away? Uh, well, we shampooed the carpet and washed the drapes. <laughs> we go away for the weekend, and we can't even rely on you to wreck this house. What are children coming to, Lance? I'll tell you this. You kids are going to mess up this house right now, or you're going to party oh, for the next hey, month. Wait. Every night. Oh, wait. Get up. Hey, no. Get up. Hey, Boogie. Hey, no. Oh, wait. Boogie. Get down. Rod campers, take a break. Time for our campfire party. Well, can we collect some more firewood first? Isn't there another tent I can pitch? But what about the marshmallows and the hot chocolate? We don't deserve them yet. We've got a lot more chores to do. Right. Hold it, hold it. We've already cleared three campsites today already. Wait a minute, you guys. We can do four easily. Yeah. Right. We'll take us a couple hours. Hey, okay. we got plenty of Oh, come on. Hurry up. This is such an eloquent little place to dine with superb atmosphere and the service is tremendous. Mm. So what do you call these little hors d'oeuvres? I've been dying to try one all evening. Mm. I call them rat hair canapes. Oh. Huh. And what do you call this delightful little drink? Chateau de Toilette. Ah. Toilet water. Right out of my own toilet. Superb. Mm. Is it vintage? Oh, you bet. We haven't flushed it in years. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no! You guys lost this must be over! <laughs> 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 That's it. The party's over. Come on, give me the give me the hot dogs. Come on, give me that hot dog. Uh, uh, hat. Come on. The party is over. Give me that. Come on. Back to reality. 
All right, Adam. I want you to copy pages 7 to 9,742 in this dictionary. Sir, you can't make me stay here. It's my birthday today. I'm having guests over, a big party, a cake, everything. Oh, your birthday, you say? Well, in that case, I might let you off. Oh, thank you, sir. I said might let you off. If you hadn't used that excuse at least 15 times this year. Don't remember how many times last year. I think I'm stupid. I'm not falling for that again. Sir, it really is my birthday today. You think that I'm an idiot. If you'd had as many birthdays as you claim in the last couple of years, you'd be 75 years of age. Well, clever you to work that out, sir. I'm exactly 75 today. Oh. Now, you wouldn't put an old man in third attention, would you? No. Oh, oh, oh. I can't take it. Easy, sir. Uh, come along now. Yeah. Uh, oh, by the way, and a uh, happy birthday. Oh, well, hey, young lad. <laughs> many happy returns, sir. Bye-bye. Bye. Have a good day. kind of in shock right now. Okay, now, look, listen. I am going to call the police. Uh, Dad? Dad, don't be too hard on them, you know, just because they didn't clean up the place. Oh, don't you worry, Alanis. You see, those burglars are going to get their just desserts. You see, those burglars ate some salmon that was contaminated with food poisoning, and they are all going to be very sick any minute now. Talking about my girl, my girl. This party is going to be great, Alistair. I know. It's uh, for that Henry kid or something. Is it his birthday or something? Should we have gotten him a present? I'm not sure, Kai, but I was wondering why they asked for volunteers yeah. for his party. <laughs> <laughs> well, boys, are we all ready for the party? You bet. <laughs> so, what's all the stuff for? Yeah, well, that's to help us find poor Henry. Well, isn't it his party? Yes, his search party. The <laughs> devil's been missing for two weeks now. Well, does this mean there won't be any girls there? <laughs> well, sure, I'm not busy. Me? No, no, no. Hi, uh, Adam. Guess who I'm taking as my date for the network party? Someone really pretty? <laughs> Really pretty. Same here, I'm telling you. This is gonna be great. <laughs> I know. This girl is so gorgeous, Adam. Mine is too. Well, not as gorgeous as mine is. <laughs> Look, Alistair, my girl is just the most gorgeous girl in the world. I'm yeah. Well, hey, Adam, I hope we're not talking about the same girl here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you're, not, uh, you're not, you're not talking about Alanis, are you? Yeah, I am. Oh. We are talking about the same girl. Okay, well, what do we do? Fight a duel or something? Well, I don't know. Maybe, uh... I've got a better idea. While you're all green with envy, I think I'll go and ask her to be my date. <laughs> Ready? Um, wait a minute, wait a minute. Stop execution. What is it this time? Well, you can't shoot me today. It's my birthday. Your birthday? Why didn't you tell us before? Boy, that was a close one, eh, amigos? Oh, yeah, Whoa. Yeah. Hey, so can I pay Pedro? Now? Pedro, no, no, no. Look, we got some goodies for you. Oh. We got a birthday cake and we got some presents and a oh, little party hat. hat. Oh. Oh. This, is, this is really nice of you guys. All right, amigos, are we ready? One, two. Happy birthday to him. Happy birthday to me. All right, that's enough. Okay, hold it, hold it. Ready, aim. Wait a minute. Huh? Well, that's it. No movies, no pin the tail on the donkey, no girls. Oh, I'm sorry, kid. We got uh, four more birthday parties booked in here this afternoon. Mm -hmm. Amigos, ready, aim. <laughs> Doc, I, I can't figure out what could be wrong with me. I mean, I went to a party last night, and then... I got home pretty late. Now I just feel horrible. Christine, 
Did you eat a lot of junk food? Oh, no, not at all. I had maybe three plates of nachos, four or five jars of chili peppers, a couple of enchiladas, and eight slices of birthday cake. Well, it seems very clear to me, young lady, that you overindulged last night. Oh, I really don't think so, unless you mean maybe I shouldn't have put hot sauce on the birthday cake. Take two Alka-Seltzers and uh, call me in the morning. Hmm? Oh, and uh, I really want you to lay off that hot sauce. Adam, this is a choir. Yeah, that's right, Alistair. <laughs> well, you tricked me into coming here. You told me there was going to be a great big party here. Well, I didn't. I said there'd be wine. And there is the altar wine. And I said there'd be food. And there is the communion wafers. And I said there'd be lots of colorful costumes and, and music. And there is. You, Alistair, said that must mean there was going to be a big party. All right, boys. Turn to page 38. Oh. And uh, by the way, Adam, thank you for bringing that recruit. Uh, $10, the agreed on price? Yeah, yeah. Mm. Thank Good. you very much. You may go. Ah, 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 not you. Page 38. Come on, sing. Oh. Uh, hey, Barfy. Uh, do you do catering for big parties? Uh, catering? Oh, yeah, big as you want. Okay, then I'll have, um, a mm hundred -hmm. burfy burgers. Two uh, hundred burfy fries. Wow. Uh, and, and ten gallons of burfy shakes. Gee, well, well, uh, that's the big occasion. Oh, well, you see, I got this summer job at the town, and I have to put some old dogs and cats to sleep. What? Oh, oh, this food should do the trick. What? I have never been so insulted in all my life. My food is of the first quality. Okay, fine, then I'll go somewhere else. Never mind. I'll fill the order immediately. <coughs> oh, oh, oh. <clears throat> well, what's this for? Oh, it's the poor little critters. When you're finished, bring them over here. No sense in wasting all that good meat. Alanis, um... Yes, Alistair? I was, uh... Alanis... <laughs> yes, Alistair? Alanis, if you won't be my date <clears throat> for the network party, I'm just gonna have to kill myself, that's all. Oh, Alistair, how touching. I really want to help you. Okay. You'll come? No, I'll go. You'll go? Well, great! <laughs> I'll go see if I can find my father's gun. <laughs> Come on, you deadbeats. Wake up! I didn't do it. Lord, what have you kids been doing lately? Oh, well, last night, you see, Christine had this really wild party, and we all went... Oh, Christine, eh? Right? Christine? Christine, wake up! Good morning, uh, sir. Well, good morning, oh, yes, and morning, I have a sir. surprise for you, Christine. Oh, what is it? Well, I understand you had a wild party last night. Oh, Sir, it was totally awesome. Mm -hmm. Well, you're really going to be in awe when I suspend you and revoke your hall privileges and give you a failing mark in history. Why? Because I had a party? No, because you didn't invite me. I, I love parties. Wahoo! Oh, Alistair. Yeah? Did you know that Irish people have some kind of a party when someone dies? It's called a wake. Isn't that weird? What do you mean weird? It's a great idea. I mean, if I was dead, I'd want people to wake me up and join in the fun. Yeah, right. Oh, Lannis. Yes, Christine? I'm having a party with Bruce Springsteen. You want to come? Bruce Springsteen? How do you know him? Well, I don't. Well, then how can you have a party for him? You just buy some cheesies and some soda pop and watch some videos and voila. But he won't be there. Well, that's his loss, isn't it? Hey, Kai. Yes, Alistair? Would you ever go to a party with a girl? I'd go to a party with a baboon as long as there was enough food. Oh, now that would not be fair to the baboon. Hey, Christine. Yeah, Lannis? How can I get a boy to stay with me at a party? Try handcuffs. Um, Mother? Yes, dear? This costume you made me for the high school dance uh -huh. isn't exactly what I had in mind. Oh, but Alistair, you said you wanted a rainbow costume, and 
And this is a very nice rainbow costume, even if I do say so myself. <laughs> Mom, I didn't say I wanted a rainbow costume. I said I wanted a Rambo costume. Rambo! The tough guy. Dressed like this? Oh, Alistair. Nice tights, though. Oh, shut up! It's time to celebrate. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And thanks, oh. Andre. <laughs> Look at this. I've been saving this for the day that we won a ball oh, game. Yeah. We won. Here, uh, Adam. Yeah, you, you go ahead. You do the honors. Everyone ready? Everyone yeah, ready? go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. So Here nice goes. Roster, kid. You want to dig in? Okay. Let's go. <laughs> Coach, this cake is stale. Yeah. Come on. Coach, it's hard as a rock. How long have you had it? Well, I've been saving it for the day that a team I coached won a ball game. 38 years. Oh, I'm not going to eat it. Well, I'm not going to eat it. Hey, let's give it to Kai. Yeah, he'll eat anything. Hey, Kai. Here, oh, easy. He likes it. All right, Kai. Thank Kai. Dennis, <laughs> what a coincidence. Hi, how you doing? <laughs> I was wondering if um you could be my date for the network party. Oh, I'm, I'd love to. I would really love to. You would? Yes, except I can't. You see, I already agreed to go with Kai. He did ask me first, and no one else had asked me, so I had no alternative but to say yes. <coughs> Gotta hand it to you. It, uh, nice try, though. Thanks. Thanks, Al. <laughs> Gonna get your party! Wow. Oh, right. oh, Ross, that was great! How did you do it? No, 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 it wasn't me. It was the producer. He decided he didn't want to look cheap in front of the viewers. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, hit it, Adam. Okay, you Let's guys. party. Hit it ready. now. Come on, hit it go. now. Okay. Ross, this thing doesn't work. It doesn't have to. We put the music in later with the sound effects. Oh, that's great. Well, we still have the cake, guys. Yeah, and it looks good. Yeah. Go. Ross, this is made of cardboard. Of course it's made of cardboard. You know better than that. It's liable to melt under the hot lights. <laughs> and this doesn't taste like anything. It's water. <laughs> I said the producer didn't want to look cheap. I didn't say he wasn't going to spend no money. <laughs> okay, come on. Let's make like we're having a party. This is television. Wahoo. Okay. Oh, yeah. Wahoo. 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 Coming up next, Nick Knew Them When continues with A.J. McLean from the Backstreet Boys on a Nickelodeon rarity. Hi, honey, I'm home. Stay tuned. <coughs> Your mother and I trusted you, Alistair. But look at this. While you were away, you wrecked the house. Dad, I just had a few friends over, that's all. Okay, things got a little bit out of hand. Out of hand? You wrecked? The house. Dad, I said I'm sorry already. Guess this means the pool party's off, right? 